what's up you guys how's it going welcome to vlogmas day 16 it's quite late already in the day and i haven't filmed anything today because i have this um big project at work and i've been very busy and at this point it's eight o'clock and i'm just about to film the video and then i have to edit it as well plus a thumbnail and upload it so yeah it's gonna be late by the time i'm finished today i'm gonna try to recreate my most popular instagram photo ever or my most popular photo in general not just on instagram and this is the photo Pretty nice, I know. I took this in 2018, just before Christmas. That photo is definitely the most liked photo that I have on both Instagram and Facebook. And it also got reposted by this page. And at the time, it got about 60,000 likes. I've never had that amount of likes. And that was the only picture that I ever had that had that many likes, even though it wasn't on my account. But still, we're gonna try and recreate it today. The only problem is I've been so busy lately. I haven't had much time to stretch. So. I'd be lying if I said I'm in a very good shape when it comes to stretching like I think I can still do pretty much everything that I used to be able to it's just a bit more difficult we're gonna start with stretching first and I'm gonna try and get like properly warmed up and make sure to stay until the end and see what we got in the advent calendars today and I think that's it oh Christmas tree oh Christmas tree That wasn't too extensive of a warm-up, but to be honest, I don't have the patience for it because it's almost nine o'clock. Here's what I'm thinking. I kind of want this to be the frame, but I feel like this point of view is too low. So maybe if I do this, this looks a bit better. To be honest, I don't know if i want to make it wide or not because i don't know if the quality will be the same so i'm gonna try the regular one this is with the door open i'm gonna test it now and see before i wrap myself in lights oh wow it's cold it looks big oh no problem sleep yes like a lot a lot it's extremely slippery on the balcony so i don't know if i'll be able to do it there well i could just choose it uh, there yeah, so it's... There's one thing that I could try, which I remember from my gymnastics days. I could put some water on my hands, but just enough to make them sticky, but not slippery. And that used to work, but the problem is this is extremely slippery. So I don't know if my trick would be good enough, but we're gonna try it anyway. By the way, it's freezing outside. Cold? Yeah. It's fine. Oh. Like, yeah, mom. Oh, this is I think that might work, but mm, it's not gonna be easy, but I don't have time, so I'm just gonna wrap myself in lights and go for it. You have to be more... Yeah, I need to... To be honest, I think I need to go as far as I can. Do you remember how we did this? I remember these were also falling off of me. So they were also very sticky, but I can't remember how we made them. Did we use tape or... I think we just kind of made them really tight. I was kind yeah. of like a ham. I'm getting such like glass bowl flashbacks. I don't even remember where we started from. I think maybe from one arm. I think yeah. we started from the arm. Yeah. Yeah. 
that was a lot harder than I thought. They were so tangled. Probably because I've been using them as a prop all throughout Vogue Do you remember how we did it before? No, but it's tangled. It's not gonna be that complex. Well, to be honest, you can't see. I'm pretty sure we did both hands. Yeah, that's what I mean. You can't see. Yeah. I think we did one hand. No, we did both. These can be... That's too much. Because we're going to have to go back. I'm like those hams, you know? Do you know the hams with the strings? These need to be tighter because when I stand up they're gonna fall. This is so uncomfortable. Oh my god, imagine if I get electrocuted. Where is the remote for this? <laughs> I want it to just be. I don't want it to be. <gasps> There's a remote for this! Yeah. Yes! This is me in the club after COVID. <laughs> it's time to go out in the field. I'm so beautiful. Also, all that warm up, pointless. Go. That's right. That's right. It's beautiful. <laughs> Even with my stiff back. Ooh. So cold. Ooh. I'm not bent enough. I can feel it. Yeah. I think this is the best one. Oh, please be good enough for my perfectionism. This one, I think there is another one. I think I'm gonna try maybe one more. That's fine. You know how I said I didn't feel the cold? Yeah. I feel the cold. It's fine. It's exactly. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. We now know that you can do two. Yeah. What's up you guys? How's it going? Uh, I'm gonna show you the result real quick. It's gonna be a blue result. You'll see the rest after. Actually, I wanna do one more. This is my problem. I am too much of a perfectionist. Which, by the way, doesn't mean the things that I do are perfect. It means that it bothers me that they aren't. That's the last one. That is the last one. Okay. That's the last one. I think I'm really done. I'm just gonna get rid of all of the lights and I'll see you after that. Ta-da! I cannot feel my legs, I cannot feel my arms, and I got the worst cramp in my car. I hope it was all worth it. Just so you know, I've made the executive decision to post this video tomorrow, which I guess technically means that I'm skipping one day of Vlogmas. But I think it's fair because I feel like this video is gonna be really good and I really don't wanna half-ass it. And also it's it's like 10 o'clock already and I haven't even started editing and I still have some work to finish. And I said in the beginning, I said, if I skip a day, so be it. So guys, we're skipping a day, but it's okay. It was worth it. I can't feel half of my body and then the parts that I can feel hurt like hell. So, wait, does that mean I opened two advent calendars today? Huh. I say we opened two things of the advent calendar today. Let's be naughty. Let's do that. 
we deserve it it's so weird without my light in the back <laughs> i have to put them up again tomorrow by the way i've just realized i need to edit the photo as well because i want to make like a fair comparison between the old one and the new one and the old one was edited with photoshop to remove some of the cables and stuff that's gonna take some time as well so tomorrow's the day let's start with makeup revolution and today we have 16 and 17 because we're cheeky like that Ooh, my hair number 16 is a lip gloss i think we had a similar one on the first day which was actually pretty nice i've been using it a lot 17 is something small it's a little brush it doesn't say what for <laughs> i'm assuming it's for eyebrows yeah <laughs> it's a baby brush can't tell if that's useful but a for effort my hair is such a mess please excuse my hair ah Ooh, my back hurts i wonder why let's do harry potter next it's shoelaces number 17 i broke it it's one of those charms again for like a bracelet and good old friends <sighs> i'm not sure this box is gonna make it until the end of vlogmas 16 is yet another sticker and this one says regina falange which is quite cute but i mean come on i think we've been having like stickers for the last five days maybe so mm. starting to get old friends it's starting to get old number 17 is not a sticker it's a little stamp i think that's it we're done i guess i'm gonna see you tomorrow we're gonna edit the photo that i took today i'm gonna pick which one's my favorite and i'm gonna edit it on photoshop and, and i'm gonna show you so make sure you hang around for a bit longer to see the big reveal hey guys it's the next day and it's dark again today i've had such a stressful day at work i have no idea where the day went but i had to submit this project which was part of my training of course i broke the whole thing like 10 minutes before submission i mean you're not really a software engineer if you don't break the entire project right before you have to submit it or deploy it or whatever so that was stressful and then we had this team event because we have an intern on the team who's leaving and it is almost nine o'clock and i'm pretty much where i was yesterday but today i'm not skipping the day although sadly it's gonna be a late upload again but regardless it's gonna be okay i did some editing on the photo from yesterday i chose a favorite and i'll show you in a second but please don't judge my photoshop skills they're not great but so this was the original and this is my edit i'm pretty proud of my edit by the way the lights are still not up and it just looks wrong i need to put them up tonight i want to tweak the lighting so that it's as close as possible to the to the old photo just so it's easier to compare them i'm gonna say i'm not great with photoshop when it comes to like color grading and lighting and like proper photography kind of editing yeah no knowledge in that department so yeah let's do a bit more editing and then i think i'm gonna be ready to show you the big review the picture is already it took me like maybe an hour to edit it after i removed the cable of the lights i also wanted to remove the side of the wall on the balcony that you could see and basically you could just see part of the wall because we wanted to have canary wharf in the frame so we had to shoot it kind of sideways so i wanted to remove that part of the wall that you could see and then i kind of had this idea hey why don't i just remove the entire rail of the balcony basically i removed the anything that you could see from the windows and the balcony apart from the floor but the entire like frame of the door and all of that i removed it because i thought it was like very distracting and yeah, you could tell that it's Photoshop, but that's not the point. I'm not trying to say that it's not. I tweaked the lighting or tones a little bit to just make it a bit less glary. And I'm very happy with the result. So, drum roll, please. And ta-da! So these are the two photos side by side and let me know in the comments which one you prefer i'm not sure initially i really liked the old one like i really didn't like the new one at all but then when i removed the distracting elements from the door and the balcony i think it actually turned out pretty nice i really like it now so let me know which one's your favorite the angle at which uh the photo was taken is a bit different the old one from 2018 is straight 
forward like completely straight whereas this one is a bit sideways because of the canary wharf in the background so that's why the angle is not exactly the same and technically I do prefer the angle at which I am standing on the first one I do like it when it's completely straight but given that our balcony wouldn't allow that to happen if I wanted canary wharf in the background I am pretty happy with the new one as well so this is it. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Make sure you comment down below which photo you prefer. I hope at least some of you like the new one. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I hope to see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 18. Bye guys! See you.